No. Remember, he's not a concept. He's a person. We have to. We may have the. We may know the concept, Mahaprabhu, but we have to meet the person behind the concept. <laughs> That's the goal of bhakti. You have to meet the person. You have to love the person behind the concept. And sometimes, whether we know it or not, we we create in our minds a concept of God that somehow is, is comfortable for us. It's not too challenging. <laughs> and we stay with that concept in a comfort zone. But there's no relationship that we are developing. You cannot develop a relationship with the concept. <laughs> the concept is just a hint to the person and the relationship with the person. I was reading one, I read one quote the other day, very interesting, by the author of one book called The Shack. It's an interesting book about Christian Trinity. It sold 40 million copies, so some people liked it. <laughs> <laughs> and this author says, but, but theology, or to have an inaccurate conception of God, but theology is like pornography, he said. Why? He said, because it's the imagination of a real relationship without the risk of one. Wow. <laughs> I'll repeat it. So Mahendrani writes the whole quote there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, no problem. It's recorded, no problem. He said, bad theology is like pornography. The imagination of a real relationship without the risk of one. <laughs> Interesting idea. You in your mind think I have a relationship. It feels like, but no, you're not taking risk. Again, no vulnerability. You're not exposing yourself to all that would happen in a real relationship. So that's not only with pornography, that's with bad theology. With bad theology means, again, you create an idea of God, the concept of God in your mind, which is doesn't match reality, <laughs> but has no risks. That's why you create that idea, because you don't want to expose with all that it implies to have an actual loving relationship with someone like God. I mean, what may happen out of that? We don't have a clue. <laughs> and don't having a clue is a little bit like we, we start to become nervous and anxious just because we don't know what's going on there. So we create an idea of God. So externally, and we convince ourselves, I believe in God. I know who God is. I know about this. But all that's in the comfort zone. We are not risking ourselves to be in a relationship with him. <laughs> and of course, the goal of our practice is to love Krishna. And again, love Krishna means a relationship of love with Krishna, not an idea in our minds. But we should be very careful about this point. And Mahaprabhu is showing that. Again, he's the very personification of God himself saying, I'm not so sure who am I. And I'm willing to know that and explore the implications of that forever. And he swims in, in Nitinaudi. So that's our deity. So we are supposed to reflect the spirit of our deity as <laughs> his followers.